and it's Nat from Hampstead West and Cat here today and today's video is um, a quick little update and some uh, haul oh, I forgot what I was doing <laughs> um, so I'm sorry for the bad lighting I'm going to say that now because I'm filming in just unnatural light which I hate doing but I managed to delete this haul and I did like a really nice one and I filmed what my cousin got as well because I went with her but now I'm only filming what I got in bad lighting, which is such a shame. But my computer deleted everything for some reason. But anyway, besides the point, um, the reason why I haven't been on much is because my cousin from Cyprus has been over. And I, I can't really film. I know she's always with me, so it's a bit awkward. I don't want to sit there filming while she's here. I am aware that I haven't uploaded Misty Zoo Zone 2 cage tour, which I know a lot of you are really excited about seeing. Obviously Christmas is passing now, has passed, as so, and New Year's is today, well the day I'm really filming it is New Year's Eve, so that's a bit awkward as well, so I think I'm just going to do her a January one, I might do um, a January cage tour and connect it with something, I'm not sure yet, but I'd just like to apologise I haven't got it up, um, I also broke my MacBook charger again, which means... I couldn't edit on iMovie, so that was a pain. But anyway, I'm back, I think. <laughs> I've got school coming up soon, I'm going to school soon, and my cousin's not leaving until the day before school, so which is a real shame because that means that I'll be back at school and I won't have as much time. I have a lot of tests coming up as well and stuff like that. But anyway, no one cares. <laughs> I'm just here to tell you that I am going to show you what I got today and the haul, so I hope you enjoy. So starting off with um, non-pet, it is pet related, it's just not for the pets. Today in the post I got my two iPod 5 cases because that's what I got for Christmas. And I got this really adorable penguin one, um, which I'm sure everyone's seeing because they've become really popular. So I got that for my iPod. And then I got this adorable horse one here, which is my favourite. But yeah, that's what it looks like. So it's like a horse doing a smile, which I love. Um, and I got those two things today, and there's the penguin up close as well. So I got those two today in the post, and I'm expecting another one soon. Um, but that was just what I got for myself. So starting off, I got this play and climb kit from my local pound stretcher, which has an attachment called the Pet Hut. And that's where I got a lot of these toys today. It's sort of like a Via Vet warehouse because it's got ev the board and breakers range and the naturals range and everything that you can't really find in something like pets at home or local pet stores. They're quite hard to find. Um, they're normally online, but yeah, I found it and it had this um, play and flying kit. I know these aren't normally recommended, and I did get one in view of it before and I hated it. It was really bad, but they were there and I could open them and see which ones I want. I could choose which one I wanted. And this one is really good. I really like this. This is going to Misty. I threw away the box for this, which is a bit unfortunate, but yeah, I got this and um, I think Misty will really, really enjoy it. I also throw away the tag that was on this. This is the Rainbow Bridge. Again, this is for Misty. It's super duper cute. Um, the Play and Climb kit was two ninety nine, which is quite expensive, but you know, because I know you can get them for like in pennies on via that. Um, and this was four ninety nine, which is very expensive. But this is very expensive everywhere because a lot of people want it. So that's the Rainbow Bridge with like the steps. And I know Misty will love this. The next thing I got was this Boredom Breakers Activity Bridge and I had the Woodlands one but it broke which was a shame because it was Misty's favourite toy I think, one of her favourites. Um, so I got one from the Boredom Breakers range, sorry you can see that glare of the light. Um, and I've assembled it and that's what it looks like. It comes with glue so if you want to um, glue it but it actually seems really pretty well stuck by just sticking, um, assembling it so I'm not going to stick artificial glue on it. Um, so I'm just going to keep it like that, and I know that Misty is also going to love that, and that's Misty's presents I got for her, and one other thing which I'll show you now, and this was 4 99 so it was the same price as the bridge, but yeah, it's a bit bigger, chunkier, it's natural, I know she'll love it. And also for Misty, I got this crocodile. Now this is the Antos Dog Chew Crocodile, um, she's had this in for a day and she's really chewed a hole in its foot. Um, so she's getting through this slowly, and this was one forty nine, which is quite expensive, but it was at my local pet store, and that was for Misty. Um, and I'll show you the last thing I got for Misty, and then on to Mickey's stuff. And then Misty needed a new water bottle, so 
not very exciting, but she got one of these mini classic deluxe water bottles which is now on outside of her cage. Mickey got this seagrass natural tunnel which is from the naturals range and this is one with the two holes, it's quite big and large but he can have a good chew at it. I thought it might be quite good for his nails as well to grind them down a bit because he's got very long nails. For him the seagrass tunnel I think it was like £3 which is cheap cheap I think. Um, yeah, it's a good tunnel and he loves it. And then Mickey got this sleep and play cheese thing. I'll show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like. You can bend it in a shape because it's got a hinge there. It's safe. It looks a bit like a cheese, I guess. You can have it whatever way you like. You can make it like that, which is how he has it at his cage at the moment, to look like two slices of cheese. Or you could do something like that, which makes it look like an actual block of cheese, but you probably have to like glue it in place there. But yep, that was £4 I think, and it's a nice little um, block for him to play with and there's loads of holes which he will love. The last thing Mickey got was one of these Antos dog chews as well. As you can see he's had it in the exact same length of time as Misty, but he's chewed off the tail and a leg. So he really loves these. Um. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to like my Facebook page or maybe add me as a friend. There'll be loads of up videos this new year. Mickey's having a drink now, that might be what you'll be able to hear. Every time I film, the pets decide they want to wake up and make noise. <laughs> but yes, I got them nice new toys. Um, you may have been aware that I didn't have what I got my pets for Christmas video because I thought I would go crazy on them after Christmas when I had the money and when there's sometimes sales, which is why they're getting toys now and not at Christmas. They don't know it's Christmas. Um, I love to give them Christmas presents. But now there's three of them, I feel a bit bad if I don't have enough money to buy them all or something. So this was the hamsters haul, um, there'll probably be a cat haul soon for Tiggs. So I hope you'd enjoy this video, don't forget to give a thumbs up, like I said, like my Facebook page or maybe add me as a friend, add me as a friend. I've also got Instagram now which is quite exciting, so I will post that below if I can figure that out. <laughs> Other than that I hope you have a very happy new year and thanks for watching guys, bye bye!